Bill Gowdy check him in. <laughs> oh, we had some thunder boomers last night. I'm telling you, big go downpour. But you know what? I'm hungry. I watched uh, Helga, Pennsylvania cooking. <laughs> she did some stuffed peppers. I watched Carolina Chris do some stuffed peppers. And I did some stuffed peppers in the Dutch oven. But, <laughs> hemp seed attic. I'll put a link to her down below. Oh, Lucy Lou. Can you see her? Yeah. The hemp seed attic told me that she halves her peppers, grills them, cooks up an egg, however you want, and then tops it with Frank's. Well, I've tried that, and I'm telling you, I'm on to something. So I've made me a breakfast pepper. I use, instead of using the Franks, I'm using, uh, uh, ground pork, an egg, cheese, garlic, onion. You just have to check it out. Check this out, will you? I like my peppers just a little crispy, not quite, you know, soft all the way through. So I take them off now. Ah, yeah. Add a little butter. Mushrooms, onion. Garlic. Uh, I had one jalapeno from the, my plants, and that is a whole head of garlic. Yeah, I, I like my garlic. I'll saute this now. Yes, yeah, so you could season this with a little salt and pepper, or cavenders, or whatever you want. I'm not going to put anything on mine, but. You sure could.
You're going to hear me say it. <laughs> yes, you are. Look at the goodness. Oh, yes, I could do this in the Dutch oven. But it's raining. Yeah, it's a rainy day. I think I'll go get supplies today. Oh. Let's dig into that, shall we? You know, this Ezekiel bread toasts so nice. It is just excellent toast. It really is. I mean, look at that. You look at that, and I like, I like that gooeyness. Look at, yeah. I like to dip my toast into that. Just like that. Mmm. Look. Mmm. Mmm. That toast is so good. And I, I tell you what, I'm getting this perfected. This is just excellent. An excellent breakfast pepper. I want to thank the hemp seed addict. She's the inspiration behind all this. You know what? You know what this needs? Mm hmm. You know what? No breakfast is complete. <laughs> yeah, no breakfast is complete without a little Texas Pete. You can tell that this has uh, been well used. I use it almost every day. Oh, look at that. I can taste those jalapenos in there. Mmm. That protects the peat really makes a difference. It really does. What a way to start the day, huh? Mm. Even if I couldn't cook it outside, I, uh, I managed to make it good inside. It really is good. Listen. I'm shifting gears. I'm going to run town and get supplies and get stocked up. Might as well. It, they're talking rain for maybe a couple days. I don't know. But uh, I sure can't. It's just, we get, we had thunder boomers last night, and I'm telling you, it's just way, way too wet to do anything outside. So uh, I got to do something else. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Go Gowdy out.